Hello lovely ladies, this is Michelle Bartel. I'm an independent gel moment distributor and today I'm going to show you how to cap your nails. You're probably even wondering what does it mean to cap one's nails? Well, I'm going to show you two different techniques on how to do so. What it is, is when you put polish on the ridge of your nail tip and that just is going to give it a little bit of extra protection to help with the longevity of your manicure. So if you were to hit the top of your nail, you have that little layer so that it doesn't chip up. All right, so there's two different techniques. The first technique is going to be with a longer nail. I would consider a longer nail one in which you can see the nail over top of the ridge of your skin on the back of your hand. And then the second technique is going to be for a shorter nail girls. And short nails are cute too. Um, and they also need to be capped. And there's a way to cap them because if you can't see it on the back of your, over the ridge, then it just makes it trickier. I'm going to show you the technique on how to do that without getting it on your skin. Without further ado, let's get started with technique number one, which is doing your longer nail. Today I'm going to be using Raven's Kiss for this demo because I think it's going to be a little bit easier to see on camera what it is that I am doing. I roll my polish, don't shake it. When you shake it, you add air bubbles and that makes your polish more gloppy and you don't want that. So nice roll three to five times and minimum polish on your brush because thin, thin layers are going to give you a better long lasting result. So I'm just going to polish my nail like normal. I like to leave myself a little border all the way around and then that way I also don't get it on my skin. All right, I am now at the stage where I'm going to cap my nails. So I'm just going to take it, I'm going to pull the skin back just slightly and then I'm just going to go along the tip. Like so. And then I'm just going to smooth it out to get rid of any ridges that that might have caused. And then I'm going to use my professional LED lamp for 45 seconds to cure that. I'm going to do one more layer of this polish. Make sure your polish is far enough away from your light radius so that it does not cure inside the bottle. Maybe longer. There we go. All right, and we're completely cure, just like that. But let's do one more layer, just because I would like to get it a little bit of a dark. Um, I'm gonna do the same thing for capping. I just pull the skin down slightly, just so I don't get it on the skin. And I just go along the edge, like so and pull up the polish just to get rid of any of that ridge. And we're ready to cure once again for 45 seconds. And that, my friends, is how you cap a longer nail. Let's move on to technique number two where we are going to cap our shorter nail. Again, I'm gonna be using Raven's Kiss for this. Just makes it a little bit easier to see, that's all. I start with polishing my nail like normal. If you don't know, I just kind of start just a little bit above the, not in the middle, but a little bit above the bottom. I start there, I push down, and then I pull up. And then I just leave a little bit of a border all the way around my nail bed, just so I don't go on the skin. All right, now I'm ready to cap my shorter nail. So instead of holding my brush this way, I'm now going to point my brush away from me. I'm going to kind of give it a jimmy, 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 push all the way around along the nail. And by pushing it just past the tip, but not touching the skin, you're putting a little bit of a cap over top. So just by pushing it over the edge just slightly, that's going to be capping it. And then again, you just pull your polish 
right up to get rid of any of the ridges. We're going to cure that. Polish away from the light. Alright, so I'm going to do one more layer just to get it to the depth of color that I'm like aiming for. So again, just kind of polish my nail like normal. There we go, and I'm going to cap it once again. And again, I'm just going to go Jimmy, 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 Jimmy. I don't know who Jimmy is, but it helps me <laughs> with the motion. And so yeah, I just jimmied it all the way along the edge. Pull out any of the ridges. Just like that. And that, my friends, is all there is to capping nails with technique number two. I'm using my professional LED lamp. It takes 45 seconds for four fingers at a time. And I didn't realize how spoiled I had gotten until I'd lent it out and was using the one minute lamp. And it's a game changer. I highly recommend the professional lamp and the deluxe lamp. They're, they're worth it. The one minute lamp though is awesome for traveling because you can plug it into your laptop or into any USB plug-in. Yeah, so there's benefits to all of the lamps. I just, I'm partial to my professional one. And there we go. We have our nails capped and ready to go. Thank you so much for joining me today. I enjoyed spending time with you. Until next time, bye.